हेलो गाइस आई एम मंगेश वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल एज वी डिस्कस्ड आई विल बी अपलोडिंग वीडियोस रेगुलरली बेसिस ऑन मेन फ्रेम सो यस्टरडे वी सॉ दैट आई बी जेनर यूटिलिटी सो टुडे वी विल सी हाउ वी कैन डिफाइन द विशम फाइल इन मेन फ्रेम सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट जॉब कार्ड यू कैन डिफाइन जॉब कार्ड आई हैव ऑलरेडी स्पोक विथ यू गाइज हाउ टू डिफाइन जॉब कार्ड इन प्रीवियस वीडियोज इन माई मेन प्रेम बेसिक वीडियोज इफ यू हैवेंट सीन दोज वीडियोज फर्स्ट गो थ्रू दैट वीडियोज देन ओनली यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड दिस वेरी वेल गो स्टेप बाय स्टेप ना यू कैन सी माई प्ले लिस्ट यू कैन डाउनलोड इट यू कैन वॉच फ्रॉम फर्स्ट वीडियो देन ओनली यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड वेरी वेल सो this is the job card name you you know how to i am assuming that you know you have watched my previous videos so you know how to give job card so this is the step you can give anything see hash 01 step is 01 uh, the step is id cams so it is one utility okay so through that utility you can define the vsam you can copy the one data set to another data set uh one vsam to another vsam as well i hope you have seen my uh, previous id cam steps what is the use of id cams and how we are using in mainframe so here we are using id cams utility to define the vsam so this is, uh, so first uh, before defining vsam uh, first step is to delete that vsam because we don't know mm, uh, that uh, vsam name might be already present in your catalog so first step is always first delete that cluster and then define it again if if that cluster will be there it will delete and create again so this is what it means you know that sys print dd sys out sys out sys in dd star you know this these steps so delete means it will first delete that cluster if that cluster present in catalog then it will define the cluster so for defining cluster the name should be this one okay reuse what is the meaning of reuse okay reuse means if that vsam uh, if that vsam having data so in second time whenever you are loading some data inside that vsam so you need not to define that vsam again if it is there you can directly load i will show you how to how this load of data in vsam uh, that jcl that code i will show you after this so first here you have to just uh, give concentration in how to define so while defining itself we are giving reuse it means if uh, there uh, this uh, vsam will be there we can we need not to define it again uh, we have to just load we need not to make that uh, vsam empty okay so after that there is vsam p vsam there is buffer space this parameter you can give as it is cylinder uh, you can it is actually depends on your data present in that files uh, it will you will get that knowledge what is the parameter should be give, given as per your experience so you can give anything okay but uh, if you are fresher and all you will be get you will be given that uh, the uh, parameters you will be in your exam as well or in your company as well they will tell hey, you create that vsam having space cylinder 50 primary and 10 secondary okay after that share option 2 3 you can use directly same like this after that data see how vsam file looks like vsam file in your jcl if you search you will see three components for vsam this one this is the cluster this is the data part and this is the index so this is how we sam looks like if you after defining you can see this three components in your catalog catalog means uh, your start uh, 3.4 option so you can see that so this is the actual meaning of vsam okay so first one is cluster second one is data part and third one is index part so you have to define data as well so you have to give name for data same name like cluster 
dot dat dot data a uh, record size uh, that uh, vsam should have some record length right l recal record size that you can give remember one thing record size can be same or it can be variable uh, vsam can be fixed with fixed uh, record length and it can have variable l recal as well that you will be seen, seeing in next up, uh, upcoming videos so cics 4096 keys it is also a very important parameter keys means uh, your vsam uh, having some index right uh, like it is uh, sorting as per uh, uh, one uh, field so this is the field 13 your vsam you know that vsam uh, file cannot have that duplicate data because it is sorted right so 13 0 means uh, from 0th position to 13th position that field will be keys primary key constant and all you know that so it will be keys it will be sorted according to this field only after that index name vsm.ab wsm.pd4.index css you can give the same name index will be same like cluster.index do not forget this iPhone. Most of the case we forget this hyphen and we are end up with JSL error. So you can see after cluster you have to give this, after use you have to give this space then hyphen ok and save this job, this job in your PS file and submit it. You will get maxis is 0 and you can see this 3 components in your catalog so this is how we can define the vsam so in this video we have seen we see this how to how we can define the vsam through id caps in next video we, we will uh, we will upload video for alternate index for vsam file yeah actually there is one another concept of alternate index that we will see next video Thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video if you found this channel is very uh, useful for you you can join the channel like share and subscribe my channel yeah okay and if you have any doubt you can comment it down okay thank you guys